Hi everyone! Hi! Hi! What is up? It's me, Kaylee, back again with a friend. I never have friends like this on my channel. This is my best friend, Azure. Hi! Hi! Oh my gosh, this is so cool. We have been talking about making a video for a really long time now, so... We're finally doing this and we're doing our makeup. I've gotten a lot of requests in the past to do a get ready with me type of video or like a tutorial because I always show my makeup on my um, social media. So here we are and I have my friend who literally taught me every single thing that I know. She wanted me to do her makeup on camera and do like a side by side like Haley does half, I do half, but she's gotten so good. It didn't make sense what? to do that anymore. Oh, so. so we're just gonna do our makeup and we're gonna chat a little bit and I'm gonna get to know Azure, gonna get to know me. <laughs> hey. Wait, talk normally? I think I'll just like talk normally. Hello? No, just say like it like, hey yeah. Azure, what's your name? Hey Kaylee, what's your name? <laughs> Azure is the queen of makeup, honestly, oh, in my opinion. She's taught me everything I know. Kaylee has these beautiful big eyelids that are fun to paint. Let's just get started. I have a bunch of questions. So I washed my I didn't okay, so I didn't wash my face. I used Bioderma, but I'm gonna go ahead and moisturize with my drunk elephant. Sponsor me. Yeah. Okay, so I bought the sample for my birthday and I fell in love with this. I'll be using the Tatcha Silk Canvas. So you use that and then you also use the primer? I use, yeah, I use the moisturizer and then the primer. Okay. And I also use a Tatcha primer. I also use a mini version because a bitch did not want to pick for that full one. I literally have mini versions of everything. I have a mini version of this, mini Fenty. <laughs> <laughs> um, I have a mini uh, Becca highlighter. Um, hydration. Okay, thank you. Here's a fun fact. I thought <laughs> I thought you'd take it because it was kind of like bulging out of it when I first got it. I thought you went like this with it. So it has literally shit and gunk all of it. I looked at it. I opened it and she goes, yeah, I used it and I didn't like it. And it didn't have any dents in it. And I said, Kaylee, did you just take it and rub it on your face? I did. And it was like all dirty and it had hairs on it. It has hair in it. It literally has pubic hair in it. We're sharing a small mirror. So I don't know how yeah. this is going to go. I, I can't see myself. Oh my God, my nose itches. Let's get to work it's the <laughs> it's the hollywood <laughs> are you okay <laughs> the hollywood flawless filter for a superstar youth glow that's why it's a f***ing trunk full wait hold on let me answer some wait wait no, no please don't do that right now wait what Speak English, bitch. Anyways, while I have you here, I just want to let you know that I am now going to be uploading videos every Sunday and Thursday. Look out. <laughs> Wait, what is that? Is that the primer? It's kind of like a highlighter primer. You see, she, every time, I literally see her so often, but every time I go to her house, she's always has something new. Or this is the beauty blender that I literally shoved in my butt. Just kidding, I didn't. <laughs> okay, she don't care, it's okay. Okay, I got a lot of questions on how we met. We met in high school. We met in high school. Yeah. We were 16, I think, when we met. I think it was like 15. We had a bunch- Was it 15 or 16? Girl, I don't no, know. 16. No, it was 16. No, 16. It was 17, 16, 18, 19, 20. I don't know. 21, 22, like 23. Soft. I'm using a Morphe sponge because this is, I really love the tip. And I also like how you can get underneath your eyes with that. We met in high school. We had a bunch of, I knew of her, but I didn't know her at all. So I'm taking my NARS and I'm putting it in my eyes. Wait. In your eyes. I'm putting it inside oh, my eyes. Can I use that as primer too? Yeah, go ahead. Oh my God. Okay. So you gave me shape tape and it was nasty, dude. You gave me, she gave I me. I thought it wasn't that perfect. And hand me down. I thought as, it wasn't used. I literally take it out and it's gunky. I thought it, <laughs> it wasn't was, used. <laughs> I had to throw that shit away. So I really don't know how to do my makeup. I, um, do. I do, but I also don't know if I'm doing it right. Do we give like the story on how we became friends though? Oh, yeah, we should. Um, so, uh, yeah, I had a friend and she, we, her and I were not getting along. This was like on the tail end of that friendship. It's weird because I ended friendship, a friendship with her and then I started a friendship with yeah. you. Yeah, basically like she had this friend who was really... She was mean. mean to her and brought her down. You know what's so weird though? I've talked about this friend in the podcast. Really? Yeah, which Azure does not listen to. I'm just gonna put that out there. <laughs> <laughs> You're making me look oh, all bad. No, she's busy, it's fine. Okay, I've just been really on my true crime grind. I know, I know. And Once you're on one type of podcast, it's really hard I to do know. I know, if anyone likes true crime cold, it's a wondery podcast, is amazing. Um, it's about the disappearance of Susan Powell, so no one cares about that. Um, my, my shit is so wet. Ew, Kaylee, go and turn I'm it off. Just, but anyways, so Kaylee had this friend. Can we give her a name? Like, give, like, just so- I, On the podcast, I called her Rachel. Okay, so <laughs> Kaylee had this, friend, had this friend, her name was Rachel, and Kaylee finally told Rachel off and was like, you're being really mean to me, like- 
I really don't appreciate that. And I could see Kaylee was really down and I felt like other people were not on Rachel's side, but like, they were not on my side. But they were on Kaylee's side for standing up for herself. And I could see Kaylee was feeling really down. Yeah. And she was like really the only one who like actually consoled me and was like, are you okay? And I was like, okay, no, I'm not. I and just, then we went to Panera and talked about it. Yeah. And I'm pretty sure like I, you got a Greek salad and I like yeah. ate your leftovers of your Greek salad. <laughs> <laughs> and that's, you're like like the first thing she says can i have your feta <laughs> something's never changed no i don't even remember what she's i got still picking, even to this day you're still picking shit off my uh yeah okay this is okay after i clean this it's all of a sudden extremely wet i cleaned all of my brushes and beauty blenders and this is so wet now really i don't know what brush i want to use ew sorry are you dripping that on the floor i'm garbage so i think i want to use my james charles palette Bruh. Oh, hell no. <laughs> Bitch. <laughs> Someone said, what is your perfect place to me slash deep talk, have a deep talk? The car. The car and the car. Spiller. Oh, yeah. We have our yeah. we have a coffee shop called Spiller yeah. in our neighborhood, and we go to that all the time. The car. I remember we used to talk in high school. We used to talk about our shit in the car all the time. Before Kaylee like had her license, she lives right by our high school that we went to. Yeah. And I would take Kaylee home. Oh, you would? I forgot Yeah, remember? That. Yeah. And so you owed me rides for like forever. Yeah, I <laughs> After did. After that. No, I didn't care. But um, <laughs> she says, I didn't care. <laughs> I didn't care. No, I didn't care. Using my James Charles palette, yeah. which I'm just going to hide and say this. James has done some things that I am not agreeing with. I'm really thinking burnt orange today. Someone said, what's your favorite makeup color to use on your eyelids? I love pinks. And oh, I'm like pink 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 i think i love i really love my james charles palette honestly because it has so many colors in it i kind of feel hypocritical i'm not even gonna lie like let's be real for a second i am i feel hypocritical not agreeing with his some of the stuff that he says but also oh, yeah. using his palette oh yeah for sure i, I don't know I what mean, to do because i guess i could stop using it but then i've already paid for it so i don't really know no, i understand leave it down below from. leave your opinions because i really want to know and i'm just being honest here so the end <laughs> okay so i did this look the other day it was like a pink fairy look but i don't know how i'm gonna recreate that shit that looked so that good was really it was good. beautiful i think i'm gonna go in with some red oh someone said what do you get at starbucks is that stupid no offense so i'm just gonna go in and pat the creases i'm not used to doing this on such a small mirror either i always get a venti iced coffee black iced coffee with cold with some type of cold foam whole milk latte with two raw sugars Ugh. i'm sorry whole milk makes you want to Die. Okay, I'm not gonna latte lie. is delicious. Oh, what's our favorite thing to do together? Drink coffee. Like, if she goes, you want to get, yes, I already know the question. I already yeah. know the question. I, we literally talk shit and drink coffee. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I've never done before? What? A rainbow look. Maybe today's not that day. <laughs> <laughs> I honestly, when I go in, when I start doing my makeup looks, I never know how it's going to turn out. I never have a vision. Do you? Yeah, usually, I because I get inspired by like different colors, but it's sometimes I just go in and play True. around with makeup. I do that a lot. If I'm like feeling down, yeah. I just like, uh, create honestly it. creating like your face is a canvas. It's art. Right. Makeup is art. It really but is. I really want to talk about something. What? But, okay, so Tana Mojo posted on her Instagram. Did you, saw, I know that probably made you so mad. Yeah. Okay, so for those of you who don't know, Tana put on her Instagram how she wanted to find a makeup artist, but but only give them promo as compensation and not pay them and it i tweeted like how like literally how dare you like yeah like being a makeup artist is art it's and a craft people already don't want to pay people let alone artists in general right so it's like how dare you like Promo can only go so far, it doesn't pay your bills. And like, honestly, it really, it truly run me the wrong way. Yeah, that Especially with someone's pocketbook, like Tana. Pocketbook. <laughs> Are you an old lady? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like money she like makes Tana. money. She's not. Like it's not like she can't mm, afford. She's not pay. struggling. Right. And then I'm, I'm just gonna, not feeling like super inspired by what I'm doing right now. Oh. Boring. I think so I'm gonna go over. in with another orange. How does this look so far? I mean, I, I, are you gonna blend it? Yes, I'm gonna f blend it. And then I'm gonna go in with a lighter color. I'm gonna like do that and then I'm gonna blend it all. Actually, no, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just gonna go ahead and blend this maybe. I literally post my best work on Instagram, but now it's like, I feel like I'm gonna let everyone down. Um, My biggest pet peeve would probably have to be not speaking about, not talking about your feelings. That really grinds my gears. Like I know it's really hard to talk about your feelings as it is, but when you just don't do it, it, it yeah. truly, put such a stint in people's relationships. I think mine no. is when people complain, but then don't take action about that was me what for they're 18 years. complaining about. <laughs> that was me for so long. I, I literally did that for so long. 
I wasn't going to say anything. No, but I did. But that, but that is my biggest pet peeve, though. Oh, what's our favorite memory together ever? Mm-hmm. Okay, we have all these plans to travel, so hopefully when that happens, we'll, we'll travel. Right. Well, we'll make memories. I feel like it's more about, like, the small stuff. Oh, yeah. I, I love doing small like, things with you. Just, like, the small little memories. Oh, how does this make? How's that going to look? I think good. Is that going to look good? I think so. For spring break, we went to the Universal Studios. That was so <laughs> fucking sorry, junior year, but yeah. honestly. Okay, I literally just blended all that off. I think. Oh. <laughs> what the hell? When we were in college, we did CrossFit. We did CrossFit a lot. Okay, I'm on not a hiatus, but it's really hard for me to get back into it. I'm trying to. She's trying to give me my space. I know I you know. care though. I know. I know you give a fuck. I try to get her to go like every every day with me. So. If you guys got matching tattoos, what would it be and why? We've talked so much about getting matching tattoos. We can't come to a consensus no. on this. We cannot decide. It's gonna happen probably one day, but know. can you still see the yellow in this? No. How do I get it to stay while blending it? How do you do that? Yeah. I just packed it on before. Azure, thank you for getting me into makeup. Yeah. Because I love it. It's so fun. I used to do her makeup all the time. All the time. But now it's like I can do my own makeup and it's like kind of like the bird, le- the mom, like me leaving the nest. It is. Because I'll be like, I'll just do my makeup. So what's so why is life so damn hard? Girl, I don't know. Question. <laughs> it's a good ass question. We don't know the answer to. Oh, what is your favorite TV series? We can talk about that. <laughs> right now? <laughs> What are you going to say? <laughs> I'm hooked on Love Island. Oh my god, disgusting. I'm really hooked on that. It's not my favorite TV series, but that's what I've been watching. I honestly don't really watch TV. Yeah. My favorite of all time. You don't have cable. You know what it is? No. Game oh, of Thrones. Game of, Game of Thrones. Don't talk to me about that fuck shit. They're all going to die. Tell, tell us in the comments who you think's going to end up no, on the throne. No, don't talk to me about that. Leave, no, leave a comment. comment. Who do you think's going to end up on the throne and... Who do you think is gonna die in the big battle scene? Don't this talk to me about that fuck shit. I will not. I will not. I will not. Leave her a bunch of Game I of Thrones. I will fans. not. She's triggered. I will not f- entertain this idea. Yeah. She's like so salty at people who watch Game of Thrones. Okay, so there are far better TV shows that don't get twice the hype. I'm sorry. You haven't even watched it, so you can't even say that. I watched the first you, nine episodes. I'm you, sorry, but I did. you haven't watched the series. I won't, you can't I won't talk say about that. I won't talk about you this. You can't video. say that. Anyways, I'm next, gonna walk away. Anyways, video. next part of my makeup routine is I'm gonna start on my face makeup. Oh, oh my god, god, I'm not even close. <laughs> oh shit. What's your favorite TV series? I have so many. I think Parks and Rec would be my, my favorites. I really love that Parks and Rec. Oh wait, I know yours. It's office. It's, it is office, but it's also Parks and Rec. I, I like the office because it's just like mindless, funny shit. But Parks and Rec shows like the importance of female friendship. And I really love that. They put like such an emphasis it's a vibe, on- you know? This is the first time I've like, I've like done this correctly without having to use tape. Do you have any merch coming soon? I don't have merch coming. I wish I did, but I have some ideas. I just don't know what to do. Tell me your merch ideas. I, I did tell you my merch ideas, okay. but I'm not telling anybody else. Okay. I want no one to steal it because everyone's a f-ing stealer. <coughs> oh my god, are you good? <coughs> oh, damn. oh my god, your upper lip's sweating. I think <laughs> I just inhaled my low self-esteem so next i'm gonna go in with a topper i have this this touch and soul it's a korean brand it's pretty cool i'm just gonna put that on top it's super pigmented i even i think there's i love toppers i'm obsessed with them and i want more like right now want to go to sephora no (laughs) someone says how can i learn to love myself taking it one day at a time i agree like just taking it one day at a time and not comparing yourself to others. I'm kind of like, I know I'm personally like pretty absent on social media just because I find myself playing like a compare game if I post constantly yep. or if I feel like, oh, I have to get the perfect picture. Oh, I need to post to show someone something. Like yeah. I find myself going into like more of a, I don't want to say self-hatred because it's not that bad, but it's more so like I find myself People will playing though, this- though. Playing this compare game. Doing little things for yourself oh, can yeah, really that build too. that up. I'm big into like self-care. Yeah, like going like, going alone somewhere or even putting makeup on or treating right. yourself to nice clothes. Like something that make your... Yeah. Honestly, I hate saying this, but sometimes... And it really was... I did not think... I thought this was all bullshit. I got you really into this. What? The whole like aspect of like taking... Like, yes. I don't want to say taking care of yourself, but like... Like when you... Making when you, yourself feel good. When you feel good on the outside, you can you can start to feel good on the inside. And I, I thought that was bullshit. I'm like, oh, it's it's so- um, Shallow. It's so shallow. But like when you like, when I put makeup on, I'm like, okay. But I also love my face without makeup. So right. what did you study in college? It was journalism and minored in political science and sociology. And yeah. She's smart. It. I use a combination for my foundation of Wet n Wild and NARS, but I'm basically almost out of both my Wet n Wild. So we're, we're, we're I'm skimping real right now. Um, what do you use for foundation? Um, I use the 
Dior face and body is my favorite of like all time. I love that one. And I love the NARS natural radiant. You too. gave me so much makeup. Yeah. She gave me so much foundation that I don't even know how to use. I did not know you can mix foundation in the beginning. I thought that was stupid. I'm like, what is this? But you literally can and it makes the world of difference. Cause I literally found my perfect shade. And I, I, it literally took me I years. I was gonna mix these two together because I like to mix these two, but. I yeah. It took me like so it. long to realize that you sometimes have to mix in order to get what you want when it comes to foundation. I say that now, I'll probably look like the peanut butter baby. <laughs> The peanut butter baby. Wait, I'm a baby. How are you honestly? Oh, <laughs> I've been struggling, I won't lie. I mean, I've been fine. I mean, just like the daily grind can be really stressful of work yeah. and going to work, working out, taking care of my dog, you know? Yeah. Day to day things just, you get into this, I don't wanna say rut, but it can but be it's that just way. like it's like a burnout rut it's just like you do the same thing every day yeah you're happy it's, it's just hard i'm just tired <laughs> i feel like i don't have a lot of time to myself and do a lot of the things that i would like to do yeah i feel like being a young adult especially us like we're in our early 20s it's literally all about figuring it out and if anyone tries to tell you you should have your shit together when you're in your 20 your early 20s that's a lie, that's a lie. And literally everyone I know is like, I have no idea what's going on. Even when you're like in your teens, it's like you still really don't know what the f is happening ever. In your life path, like where I thought I would oh, be. Oh yeah. It's like, like I remember when we were, so okay, different. let's do a comparison. We were, when I was leaving high school, I remember you wanted to work for an NFL team. You wanted to be an NF, NFL. I wanted to be a sports writer. She wanted to be a sports writer. I wanted to direct movies. <laughs> And neither one of us are doing those no. things. No, and you know and what? I'm happy not doing it. And that's it. okay. Dude, I think I've always wanted to be a YouTuber, but I never thought it would happen. Right, like... That was like a pipe dream. Right, honestly. it was like, I want to be a YouTuber, but this isn't something that... It's sustainable and right. stuff. Have you seen each other puke? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Um, you're kind of looking like Flashback Mary in the beef you find her. I know. Oh, I'm, so like, I'm looking at myself with the light on me. I look so fucking busted. Oh my god. How, you know what? This is why beauty gurus have like a trillion lights. I look so fucking. Should I put the light up more? I don't know because Should I, I do don't that? look like this in real life. Yeah. Can I, I try your Fenty highlighter? Oh, for sure. Mm -hmm. I am obsessed with that Hustler Baby one. Oh, bitch. She's good. So I'm just going to go ahead and put some. Blonde, bronzer? Ooh, that's so pretty. It's so pretty. Yeah. So in high school, no, but I was gonna tell your throw up story, your blue motherfucker. <laughs> Wait, but no. On our 18th birthday. <laughs> no, it, no, it wasn't. It was the going away party for college. It was, no, 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 this was our 18th birthday. Uh, no. Yes, it was. It was our going away oh, college whatever. party, whatever. We had like a going away college party with all of our friends and we made these drinks. So we'd like been to Athens to like party when we were in high so school. So in high school, everyone's obsessed with Athens, Georgia. And when you're in high school, everyone everyone in the metro Atlanta area wants to go to the University of Georgia so bad. It's, so they go to Athens and they party their brains out Athens, in high school. Athens it's is like a very big party town. But we were in high school and we would go and visit people in Athens and go out to the bars. And there's this drink there. It's we called, were obsessed with this drink. Oh yeah. It's called a blue mother <laughs> <laughs> And it's like one of those drinks that like you definitely only drink when you're like 18. It's it, the grossest drink in the world. It's so nasty. It's like vodka and blue. Blue curacao. Anyways, but it's like this drink everyone's obsessed with. So we, this, we had this going away party. Yeah. And we made this drink. <laughs> Okay, no, we didn't make it. Another girl made it. So this other girl that we were friends with, she was like, I'll make the drinks. Cause she had been to Athens too. She knows what the f is going on. So she made this drink and Kaylee- Bitch, when I tell you, I was pounding that shit back. Like, like, like it was going out of style. Oh my God, I was going insane. I know it's hard to imagine Kaylee like this. I was no, in high Kaylee school. Kaylee was wild. In high wild. School, I was wild in high school. I wasn't really that wild in college. And your my, freshman year of college you were. Oh, freshman year of college was really bad, but then my mental illness started to get to me. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, go ahead. I remember pounding this back and then within 20 minutes feeling absolute shit. Like I, I didn't even have fun. Pretty sweet, so you can't. I did not even have fun because within 20 minutes I was already dying. As the light goes, I'm just like sitting there like holding my stomach. It was seriously the worst pain in my life. Like it was awful. And then I started to feel a little better and then I got hungry. So then I pounded all of the wild rice in the fridge. <laughs> Oh no, Everyone leaves the party, we go to bed, I wake up the next morning and I'm like, oh fuck. Oh fuck. I'm gonna th I'm gonna I'm gonna bomb. I'm a I'm a chuck. The mother of our friend had a rule no throwing up in the house. So I literally threw up all over her patio. <laughs> <laughs> she just walked out the door and, and it was bright blue. That's oh, the that's the whole point the of the brightest story. throw up ever. And then our friend Elena she Not had to hose it down at like 7 a.m. so no one would see what had happened. <laughs> 
was it. She hosed it down. You know, and she's she still found the hose and hosed that bitch down. And mind you, we're all so hungover. We're so we're still drunk. So moral of the story, it's okay to be an idiot. We made it. She's employed. She has her own apartment. <laughs> I have a YouTube channel. <laughs> Someone wants to know the story of Waffle's adoption. I'm just gonna go ahead and say it. I was looking to shop. I was looking to shop for a goddamn gold doodle. And I found this ad online. I found this ad online for golden doodles for like a pretty cheap price. And it was this woman who bred them. So I so I, I contacted her, gave her, she gave me the address. It was this random, it was like 20 minutes from my house. It was this random parking lot, like, like, a, like a movie tavern parking lot. This guy and her get out of the car and they start circling. Like the boyfriend or the or the the guy friend starts circling the car and it really freaked me out. And I don't know what that their intention was for that. She produces this the smallest dog I've ever seen. He was so dirty. He had fleas. He had shit on his ass. It was awful. You like, got him off of Craigslist. Craigslist, yeah. basically, yeah. And it turns out he was not a golden doodle. He was a small dog. Well, I, don't, I think he might be a Bichon. No, he's definitely Malty Poo. Malty Poo, maybe. Um, it's so funny because Kaylee walked. So we lived together. Well, I think so know that. I got this dog when I was when I was living at UGA when I was at school at UGA, and I actually was roommates with her and Courtney and another girl. And I told them I really want a puppy. I need it for my emotional stability, which I really did it. I just really wanted to fuck. Well, I mean, he helped, <laughs> but, but I just also really wanted. Yeah. To dog and so i brought him to the apartment after um adopting him from the movie tavern <laughs> yeah we're like this is a golden doodle like i love this boy like he's gonna grow so big i'm just like he must be to be really young like he they must have lied about the age or something we're just sitting there and we're all like they're that's like not a golden doodle no everyone was like Haley, that's not going i'm like yes it is when he never grew that was a problem <laughs> <laughs> i remember one day she just texted me yeah he's not a golden doodle yeah <laughs> So I got bamboozled, but Waffle has been the best thing that's happened to me. And it's taught me to 100% adopt. I had never had a dog before Waffle, so I really didn't understand. I think the whole concept of wanting to adopt like a dog. Rescue a dog. Yeah, and then she ended up rescuing a dog from the Atlanta Humane Society and literally is the best dog I've ever She's met. She's the light of my life. Like literally the light of our lives, thank I you. Know. I think I'm just going my, oh my gosh, our Fenty gloss, bomb, gloss bombs. Mwah. <laughs> Should we kiss? We're waiting. And I, oh. I have a highlighter in my inner corner now. <laughs> Did you see how right when I coughed, the lights went out? <laughs> what are you gonna be like? Oh, that is yes. so nice. Yes. Please go ahead. What is that? It's the ColourPop Flexitarian highlight. I use it in my inner corner. I think day. I might want that. It's so good. And it's like eight bucks. Okay, ColourPop is that bitch, I, I guess. I love ColourPop. This is gonna make you nice and dewy. Shut your mouth, it tastes nasty. <laughs> I... You're about to be nice and dewy. Oh my God. Okay guys, well. <laughs> your face is still dry. Thank you guys so much for watching. This is our final look. Cover girl. Their necks look broke. Stiff to let your whole body talk. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching this video, and thank you to Azure for no, coming up you. on my channel. Thank you for having me. I guess don't forget to love yourself. Yes. And love and live. Bye, guys. Bye. <laughs> I've been editing all night, and it's the morning. Good night. Cover girl, put that bass in your walk. Head to toe, let your whole body talk.